Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome. Welcome to Friday. We are here tonight to finish up Wolfenstein 2, the new Colossus. We finished up the story a few days ago, but we've been doing the Enigma side missions for the last few days. And we've got four left to do. Um, there's, an, there's an initial set of 15 in, that are scattered amongst some of the areas that we played through in the campaign. And once we finish those three, from what I understand, there's supposed to be an additional one that unlocks when you do that. Um, one of the things that we did, uh, that I did yesterday was, was I went ahead and grinded some extra Enigma cards because even though these areas have bosses and stuff in them, the commanders, <clears throat> You don't have to. You don't have to kill the same target. That's the assassination attempt in the Enigma mission. But the regular commanders are, are still there, so you can go get more cards if you need them. And there's and I, and I'll go through it real quick before we get started with the stuff that we're going to be concentrating on tonight. But if you need to grind Enigma cards for any reason, there's a really easy one that you can do it in, and it takes about five minutes to get a card. Um, you want to come to the Roswell district and you want to do the downtown area. And it's really easy and you only have to kill two people. You may not even have to kill the first one, but I do it anyway because it's like right there in front of me as I move forward from the very start. Wienders. All right, so here's the start. In a crouch, switch to the pistol because you move just a tad faster with the pistol equipped. And then axe that guy, and then from here on out, you're pretty much home free to get to the commander in this area, uh, unless you do something stupid like that. That's what I was not intending to do. But essentially what you do is you hug this. And if you just keep moving, they won't see you or hear you. And you want to just walk right up behind this guy. He's not going to see you or hear you. He's going to go down to past that truck right there and he's going to stop. And he'll wait there for, you for a few seconds, and then he'll turn around and go back. He's just patrolling back and forth. So you want to come here, back behind this truck. Wait for that guy to take about three steps. And now you can move forward. There's a couple of health packs here. If you got the constrictor harness, you can just drop right in here. Move your way out. Stay crouched the entire way so you're nice and quiet. And you'll come down here, and this is where the boss is. He'll be down here with his back facing you. Come up here, ax him, kill him, get your card. And that's the end of the mission. That's it. That's all you have to do. And you can get a save here just in case. You hit your button, and you go back to Eva's Hammer. <clears throat> And that's it. Like I said, it takes just a, just a very few minutes to do that. And if you need extra cards, that's the way to do it. So, like I said, once we get back to the war table, we've got three missions, three Uber card, Uber card, Enigma card missions left to do in New Orleans, which we have not done yet. So we do those three, and that's supposed to unlock the final. Enigma card mission. Mm, excuse me. Alright, so we go to New Orleans. We did one of these the other night. But we still have these other three left. So we already got the weapon upgrade. That's what the middle symbol is. Max's toys. We don't have Max's toys in any of these three either. So we'll do, I guess we'll do this one first. Like I said before, we came through all of these areas as part of the campaign. 
so they'll be familiar, even though for some of these Enigma missions, you're going to be going through them in the reverse direction that you went through them in the story. <clears throat> Get my cable situated here. Listen, Blaskowitz. Uber Commander Otto Ackerman is located somewhere inside the wall. Security's tightened up since last time. Maybe try and find an alternate route inside. Grace out. Yeah, this this is one of the ones, you know, as soon as I say that most of them, you're going to go through them in the reverse order of the campaign. This was in the same, the same order. In the campaign, there was nobody outside at all. So I'm going to expect the same. Here, we're also going to do some due diligence on, for Max, there's a side mission and an associated achievement slash trophy for collecting toys for him. And I don't think the toys are here during the campaign. They're only here during these but I'm not 100% sure on that. Where we actually need to go for the commander is off to the left. All right, come on, BJ. But we're gonna look in here real quick for any other collectibles that we might have missed. Don't know. I don't know if those mines will blow up if we get too close. Alright. Enjoy his alligator farm. There are essentially two ways you can go in. One is, let's see, there's a ladder. There's a pipe that you can crawl through right there, but there's also, yeah, here, there, and there's a ladder which will get you up higher. I've done both. But I think we might, well, we might take the ladder this time. Well, I don't know if there's really any huge benefit of one or the other. tap the A button. They're essentially stilts that allow BJ to reach areas that he otherwise normally wouldn't be able to reach. Alright, let's go up the ladder. Interesting. All right, maybe we can. This I think this is where we went in during the campaign, but apparently we can't do that now. All right, no, no problem. We just go through here. We just have to crouch and kind of aim for the hole. And he'll automatically crawl through it. You can't stay in here indefinitely like this. Because he will start to suffocate. No way he's going to be right there above me. That would just be too easy. We try it. 
seltsam. Die Werke in der extremen Gefahrenzone da draußen arbeiten. Überall nur Strahlung und Tod. Tja. Damn dogs. supposed to get up into that hole. Maybe it's only accessible from the other side. Grounds for supplies, ammo, food. There's somebody close. Never gone below in this area. It's always been through here. A little bit of overcharge. Pick up the collectible. Grab a donut! Let's go look downstairs. Since we're here and there's nobody left.
there a wall down there? Oh yeah, we could probably crawl underneath. Let's see, is there anything in here? No. So you can stay under there for a few seconds, but eventually it'll start to crush you. Then you'll start losing health. And you can do takedowns from there too. Goldbug, hey, how you doing? Thank you for the follow. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome to the igloo. How you doing? Alright. Yes, yes, ammo is good. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and grab a save. here is where the battle walker legs come in handy. Wouldn't be able to reach those otherwise. Alright. thing a toy maybe each one of the hey how you doing welcome no it's a radio okay I thought it might have been might have been one of Max's toys how's it going Is indeed it is outstanding you know it, it won one of the one of the game awards last night for best action game thirty nine he's probably up on the third floor. I didn't even notice that health kit right there on the walkway or there or whatever that is above the door. Nice, that would be another battle walker leg spot. I still don't know what how you're supposed to get into that hole down there. Try jumping through it normally, couldn't reach it with the legs up. 
I just get an idea where this guy is. So he's in that direction. What we don't know is if he's up those stairs or not. We can bash through there. If we need to. I mean, it doesn't matter at this point if we made noise or not because the alarms are already going off. He's got the same pistol that I do, and I keep forgetting that. He's got one of the pistol arrows that does the explosive rocket RPG rounds. I have to remember that. It's not the first time one of those guys will has killed me. We just need to make sure we take our time when we get over there. Right, now this guy... I think he was right over here. regular commander. He doesn't have any special weapon or anything. Grab his card. We'll switch to this guy. And we'll do this one. The diesel craftwork. One of my favorite weapons in the game. to impress Blaskowitz. Pack it up and come on home. Grace out. I'll leave that there for a second. We still want to... We need to find Max's toy. We're, what, it's one of the other things that we're looking for while we do these. Ah, there it is right there. It's got to be it right there. Yep. Max's toy. All right, we got that. The recording. Interesting. Why are there two death cards? All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna save here just to be safe. I've never seen I've never seen two death cards. It's, a, it's almost like he died there, but I blew him up and I blew his body all the way over here. So there's a card here, too. Otto Ackerman. All right, we'll stay. All right, so that one disappeared. Okay, maybe that's two pieces of him <laughs> on the floor. So I put a card on both of them, I guess. All right, so that's essentially the end of that Enigma mission, and that's all you really have to do for these if you're not if you're not aware. Is you've got a specific target that you have to assassinate. Once you kill that person, you take the death card, and then from that point you can either immediately go back to Eva's hammer, or you can uh, you can hold on and, and look around some more like I just did. And to return, you just go back to the menus. Hit X, as you see, right above my head, and that'll take us back. And then we can pick another one. 
but for those that weren't here at the beginning of the stream, we've got three left to do. Now we have two left to do. And my understanding is once you finish that initial set of 15, there is a 16th one that unlocks, which is completely unlike any of the other ones, and it's in a completely different area that we never went to in the story. So I'm definitely interested in seeing that. <coughs> Alright, so this is the war table. And these diamonds are where you pick your Uber Commander missions. We've done all of them. In Roswell, we did the one. There's two in Roswell. There's one in Mesquite. There's three in Venus. On Venus. There are four, I believe, in Manhattan. And there are also four in New Orleans. And those are the ones that we're doing now. See, we just did that one. We can either do the ghetto or the lake view. I'm trying to remember which one is. When we came into New Orleans, there was a part that was underwater. It might be that one. So let's let's do this one. In order to get access to these, to be able to go after the commander, you have to do a mini game at the Enigma terminal. That's like on the other side of that table that I was just standing at. And each commander requires a certain number of Enigma cards in order to pay to unlock his location. And it's essentially, if you've ever played dominoes, it's two halves of a domino. And you have to use your, if you're using a controller like I am, you use your two sticks to match them up, and there's five of them, and you have 15 seconds. Blazkowicz, Uber Commander Victor Kruger has established his mobile command inside an abandoned charcoal grill restaurant, a couple of blocks from your location. He's attempting to reactivate the underwater mines around New Orleans. You gotta stop him. Grace out. You've got 15 seconds to do each of the five and you just match them up and then once you successfully do that and it's really not that difficult um, then you then it will tell you the the location of that guy I mean, when you get close enough you notice that when I oh boy pens pens are owned oh no that's not a pens are that's the smaller one I think All right. But when you see the signal detected up there that tells you the locations of the of the commanders, you'll see a normal white one. Those are just your regular guys. The blue one is your target. That's the guy you're here to kill. see any constrictor harness holes along the walls here that I could sneak through to try and get around these guys. All right, so we've got one guy there. We've got a bigger guy there. And then we've got the big dog. I'm trying to get a lay of the land here before I do anything. He's going to come here, but I don't know what the timing of the dog is going to be.
damn it, I didn't kill him, but he's hurt, though. Oh, that's not good. Blew up the pup. Killed everybody else. Now we just scrounge for whatever's left. Probably not going to be any help, but there should be ammo. use a couple of grenades so we can certainly resupply those down below. Let me check the floor first before we drop down there. See, I don't know which way we're supposed to be going, so we don't have the we don't have the marker, the signal detected at the top of the screen yet, so we don't know where he is. BJ in his skivvies. Nice. Nice. All right. something I can charge through or not. We're going to find out. It is. Alright, so it's signal detected, so that's just a regular commander there. It's not the Uber that we're after. He'll be blue. Alright, before we go outside, I'll grab a save. In the story, there was another hound just off to my left, and that's probably what you hear walking. And I also mentioned earlier that some of these areas where the Enigma side missions are, you're actually going to go through them backwards from the way you did them in the story. And that is the case here. We're going in 
came in the back door, essentially. Should be able to walk up here. Yep, all this is the same. Come up here, there's a little shack. Right here. Looks like we already got everything. Yeah, see our buddy over there? <laughs> Either. Oh, it's not a Panzer Hund. Sounds like a damn Reaper. Oh, can I pot shot him from back here, I wonder? Better not! <laughs> Dead too. Just pop back in here and see if there's any extra ammo or armor. Sorry. piercing rounds. That's one of the upgrades you can get for this weapon.
I think it's probably, I don't think we've gotten everybody, but I think it's probably pretty safe to go down now. through here. Anybody? We can bust through there, but obviously they'll be able to come in too. Alright, let's do that. We'll back up real quick as soon as we hit it. probably in here. This is a circular area. It is probably over there in the back corner, which is where we drop down into this area from in the story. somewhere. have to go back inside the building. Which I thought was like right over here, but maybe maybe it's up there instead. So open doors. No constrictor harness holes. Yeah, he's probably over there. 
probably inside the building. just a regular commander. I didn't notice before if it was blue. It'll be blue if it's the target. So we have a little ways to go still. Alright, anything over this way? No, we were already there. Nothing down there. Granada. Nothing there, we've already done that. back in the building this is the first the first building that we came into coming through it normally oh well the first half of it anyway there's a there's an air is an open area in between where there's a crane that goes across the top signals. Yeah, see there's the other side over there, the other building. right there that we rode across coming this way all right let's go down I think we can go down yeah should be I thought there was a constrictor a constrictor harness hole 
somewhere down here. Maybe not. Maybe now, because they go across up top. third guy go. Alright. Not too worried about him. About 10 or 15 rounds. Which I am getting low on ammo for that thing. My marksman rifle. About 10 or 15 rounds into him and he won't be with us anymore. in here, I don't think. Nobody else is dead. soldiers are really fast. something. I doubt it's going to work, but we're going to try it anyway. Let's try and bounce a grenade off of that p pillar there. No, it just stuck. Alright, maybe we have to... Well, we can't call it back, I don't think. Alright, so how the hell are we supposed to...
the hell is he doing? <laughs> All right, scrounge for ammo, for refills. I can refill right here. Side. I know there's a constrictor harness hole around here somewhere. Eight. Eight hatchets is the most you can carry. We can only do five during the, during the story. Stairs. Ah, <laughs> they're in front of me. Are we good? All right. We should be getting this signal. Fairly soon. I mean, there's not much. There's not much of this area left. of it. Well, unless it's going to make me go all the way back to the very beginning, then we do have a little bit farther to go, but... There's an open area right outside here. Yeah, right down there. If we go off through that bus into the water, then we can go through that building and back over in that direction. Take us back to the beginning of the level. down one level. We'll go through here. Go down these stairs and we'll go out the door on that side. I'm guessing probably as soon as we go through that door we'll get the signal for the assassination target.
Huh, interesting. See, there's the big area I was talking about, and that's the rest of it. Oh, good lord. We really got to go through. Wow. Wow. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm going to save. I think I just heard a transformer pop. We got snow here today. It's been snowing off and on all day, actually. We got a couple of inches, maybe three. Some of my friends, co-workers lost power. I have not. But that little pop that I just heard sounded like a transformer. Could be something there, but if there is, it's not much. If you can even get in there. through or under. There's nothing over there anyway. Well, I don't, well, according to the map, all right, maybe I have to bust through it, I guess. Charge through it. I was talking about lead you down into the water right before we go into the water. Come on, BJ.
Should be able to see him. Ah, it's one of the big, bigger. Alright, let's see. How do we want to do this? Go around to the left. We want to get caught in the bus. Try and go through there. Uh, that's a panzer. Panzer Hund. So it looks like he might be inside the building. triggering a conversation triggers one of them to move. Of course we can also go in here. to go that way. Maybe we'll... get behind the car. See if maybe there's some place we can go. We can sneak in. Sneak in the back of the building. deal with the dog if we don't have to.
not what I wanted to have happen. So we go, well, we went upstairs. up there. Couldn't jump across on the second floor because it was blocked by a gate. We may have no choice but to deal with them. There's at least two guys in there because him and somebody he was talking to. Let's see if we can get all the way up to the taxi. All right, that's probably him. He looked like he was wearing a, the hat. like the entryway looks like it's on the, around the corner in the front not on this side I mean we could probably we could kill him but we'd wake everybody up I mean there would only be the, the Panzerhund and his buddy left Oh, you know what? I'm wondering. I'm gonna make a save here. Right behind him. In the story, we were able to mount one of these things. Assassinate a however many ton mechanical beast. Yeah, see, there's the door. All right, let's do this. Let's go back out this way. I'm trying to do this without waking up the dog. Not that I don't think I can take the dog out. I've done it before plenty of times. The problem is he's looking this way. So what I might have to do is just charge in. See, he's right there. Just wait. Wait until he gets back over to the window. I think that's it's aimed at him. Oh, wait a minute. He's right there. <clears throat> we'll 
take a break after we finish this. It's getting to be, it's, it's, it's a little foggy, so I can't, I can't get a good look. Headshot. Yeah, see, that's his buddy. That's not him. Shit. That is what I did not want to have happen. over there asshole 
done, you bitch. All right, Blazkowicz. Let's keep this revolution going. Grace out. find some a some health we are looking for max's toy and there it is right there it's like an old vw bus yeah all right i guess we can go back even though we're going to lose. It's weird. Every time we go back to the U-boat, any any health over 100, we lose. But conversely, if we go back with less than 100, then we're boosted back up to 100. So, all right, we save. Always save before we go back. I've had plenty of instances where I try to go back like I'm getting ready to do, go back to the sub, and it would freeze. So... I make sure to say before we do that. Oh, perfect timing. Right at break time. startup music all right let's do let's do this one all right so we've got two for about nine and a half minutes we'll pause it here so yeah let me get up and go to the bathroom and stretch my legs and stuff and be back in about nine and a half sit tight
All right, we're back. Next! How many cards do we have? We've got plenty of... Oh, here's the kill board, by the way. We have one guy left. Albert Grossa. 30, age 32. Years of service, 12. Height, 189. Weight, 82. Blood type, AB. Spouse, knows. Offspring, no. Notable achievements. Awarded for distinguished marksmanship during the Antarctic Battle Station Red Moon Siege, 1949. Awarded for heroism during the Nebraska Incident, 1952. Killed three American terrorists. Captured 12. Everybody else is dead. We have 11. 11 cards. Unlocked all the locations. We just need to go kill this last guy. Let's see. Yeah, we got everything. Yeah, we need him and we need to find Max's toy. Lakeview District. <clears throat> Coming back for more. Visit every district. Awesome. It's always nice to get a bloop. I've got a commander already. Talk to me, Grace. Blazkowicz, Uber Commander Albert Groza has been sent in to salvage parts from that big ass battle robot you fucked up. Track <laughs> Groza down and put the hurt on him. Grace out. Put the hurt on him. Oh, okay. I, okay, I know where this is. Okay, got it. <coughs> Eleven. Eleven shots. Constrictor holes. Sorry, they're both there. Can das Militär den Verlust nicht vertragen? Ist das Militär pleite? Das sind die eigentlichen Fragen. Du hast recht. Ich habe gesehen, wie einer zerstört wurde, aber damals landete er einfach auf dem. Well, well, we can easily take the two of them out. With a diesel craft work shop shot into the ground between the two of them, and then we detonate it. That obviously makes a lot of noise. Wir sollten nicht noch mehr Unruhe What we can probably try to do, if we can, is try and get them lined up as best we can.
probably not going to matter at this point. They've already been broadcasting. I got the Panzer Hound or not. He was certainly on fire and damaged. left. All the records. Alright, do we have to go inside the building, I wonder? Let's look at the map. <clears throat> looks like lots of things to find. I mean, this looks like a fairly small area, all things considered. There's an alarm inside the building and some kind of... Oh, did I miss a... Uh... myself a trip. Later, potentially.
looks like a uh, Sigrun. Or something inside. Looks like it's like right here. Or up there. ammo for sure. It's not going to let us get up there apparently. Probably against the wall or on the other side of it. Don't know any other way to get up. The stairs were all broken. It's not over there. It's over in the corner. It was already over there earlier. It's right over here. Oh, all right. It's over here in this corner. Yeah, right here. There we go. That's uh, Barbara, I think was her name. Was one of the people that was in New Orleans. All right, check the map again. It looks like we have to go back. Oh, there's some alarms over there, so there are certainly, certainly some bad guys over that way. But there's also some down here. Misbehave! Thank you for the host. Welcome. Happy Friday to you. How are you? How's it going? Let's go back over this way. I didn't s I don't remember seeing any doors. Oh no! It's a hosting train. That's because Jay just finished his stream. Thank you Jay. Thank you for the host. Welcome all. Welcome everyone to the igloo. 
on a finish this game Friday. Yep. Alright, so according to the map. Excellent! Gotta be away. I am doing okay. Doing okay. Bunch of snow today, as you know. Doing the last couple of Enigma missions in this game, and then that will be it, at least for the streaming part. Is it right here? Where the hell do I get in? Gotta be a way in. There's Star Card. Pick that up. Alright. Well, maybe not. Maybe it doubles back on itself. Are you are you still playing Techromancer? Are you done with it? I know that was what you were streaming tonight, but is that still going? Okay, where the hell am I going? Yeah, this is another... <clears throat> Looks like a mason jar. Oh, it's Anya! Very pregnant! <laughs> Very pregnant with BJ's twins. Spoiler alert. <laughs> came so go to the right there's that's a dead end I know that yep that's the way we came that's a dead end that's a dead end so we go this way everybody I guess everybody went home hope oh. well we got our asses kicked already so why stick around What's up, brother? Thank you for the host. Ooh, I can swim. I'm not ready to do that yet. Make sure there's nothing here. Thank you for the host, Ty. Welcome. Welcome all. Welcome to Frozen Friday. Where we have about three inches of snow on the ground. Probably get a signal right when we get to the end, I bet. It's him! I 
could really go for a, a refuel on the diesel. The diesel craft work. Yep, as I was saying before, uh, in the beginning of the stream, a lot of these Enigma missions, you're going through an area from the campaign, but you're going through it in the opposite direction. Hi. Where we have, oh. you pal Jawohl. What the fuck are we supposed to do? Those are good for one thing, making you waste your ammo. Charge. Tippy, what's up? going well it's going well I've mentioned earlier uh, we've got three inches of snow on the ground right now hi He's only 21 meters away. Thank you, Blaskowitz. I'll let Horton know you're still looking out for New Orleans. Grace out. Grace out. Be careful what you wish for. <laughs> All right. All right, what do we got left? Let's see, there's, looks like there's just two collectibles. We gotta find Max's toy as well. I'm trying to collect all of those. Pick that up, we're not leaving, so.
All right. Star card. Edge, thank you for the host. Get you some ice here in just a moment. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome all. We are cleaning up. Where's the toy? Where's the toy? It'll be around here somewhere. Oh, nice. <laughs> so that's what that looked like up close. <laughs> that's from the campaign, by the way. <laughs> yes, Grace did beach a U-boat. <laughs> Where, oh, where did Max's toy go? Nowhere, oh, where can he be? There he is. Right there. All right, anything left? You see the rocket right there in the middle of the screen? On the middle shelf? I don't know why the rest of them are showing black silhouettes. We've gotten all of them except for one. All right, I think that's everything. Now we've got one more little thing back there. We'll go grab that. Let's see, where is it in here? Oh, it might be in the corner in the alleyway back here. Yep, store cart. All right, so we've got everything there. 200, 100, full of, full of hatchets. Full on armor, full on health. Hold on, we're gonna lose. We're gonna lose some of that health, about half of it, actually. All right, so that is it for this area. Picked everything up, killed the target. We'll go back to the U-boat. Should be all of the Enigma missions complete. My understanding is there's one more that you get once you complete the first 15. And this one is supposed to be completely different from what we just did. So, we'll see. the guy that we just did. Why is he not showing completed? Major lurking. Ah, there it is right there. This one right here at Riverside. This is this is the last one we've got to go unlock it, which means we've got to do one you, one last Enigma puzzle. These are actually not that hard. For those of you that have not seen these, no, the ones we just did were in New Orleans. Essentially, the way the, the deciphering of the locations of the Uber Commanders works is you have to have a certain number of Enigma codes to be able to attempt a minigame. And essentially what the minigame is, if you're using a controller, I don't know what the controls are if you're using mouse and keyboard, but if you're using a controller, essentially what you're going to see when I start it is it's going to be it's going to look like two halves of dominoes right you play dominoes right a lot of people have and you've just got to match them up using the two sticks on your controller and you've got the pattern that you're supposed to match across the top and there's like five of them for each puzzle 
and you've got like 15 seconds to match them up. I mean, they're not difficult. But, you know, so we've got to do this one. Let's see here. Herman Riverside Abandoned Bunker. So, yeah, see, so you've just got to match them up. And go here. We'll get that one. And we'll do this one plus the four in the middle. Do that. Getting a little ahead of myself. Yeah, so, like I said, not terribly difficult. Yeah, and it costs eight. Eight cards to eight. unlock his location. All right, so, yep, let's go do this last one. As soon as we finish this, that's going to be the end of the stream, however long it takes. It takes... So those of you that watched the uh, the Game Awards last night or saw the results, what did you think? Any surprises? Any shockers for you? Anything that you were particularly happy to see? Hellblade actually won two. Hellblade won two awards. I guess I did pick it up. I don't know how to turn the flashlight off. I would like to be able to turn it off. All right, what do we got here? What's the old saying? A long, a long maze of twisty passages all alike. Something like that. The Colossal Cave. But yes, I was I was definitely I was I was happy that they got the what was the one that they got? Get games for games for action or whatever it was that they called it. For you know the mental illness aspects of the game but and some of you you know you've, you've seen me mention in streams before about you know I felt that Melina Jurgen should have won the, the best performance um, for what she did and she did and I'm actually glad that she mentioned in her acceptance speech that she was she's the video editor at the company she's not an actress so you know, I was happy about that. I was happy about this game winning winning the action category. And Edith Finch, I was glad Edith Finch won the what was it, best narrative, I think. I was happy to see that. Played that recently. I I, I loved it. I thought it was great. I'm actually surprised that Horizon did Horizon Zero Dawn win anything? I don't think they won anything and that's that's just a shock to me.
looks like. All right. Has cat, what's up? Yeah, I'm I'm very shocked. Like I said, I'm just very shocked by that. I don't know how to turn off the damn flashlight. I'm gonna save here just in case I do something really stupid. <laughs> I guess there's no way to... That's the objective. Yeah, that does the... Uh, for each of the weapons, it has a... They have uh, uh, upgrades. And the top option... I think it's for all of them. I haven't tried, but I know for some of them, like for the one that I have in my hands right now, I can toggle the marksman scope by hitting right on the D-pad. So I can go with it or without it just by hitting the button. And it's always the top. It's my understanding. Always the top option on the upgrades. So I guess I can't, I can't turn off the flashlight. And this area here that we're in, this is not in the game. Brand new area. looks like it's blocked. I guess maybe I could try to bash through it, but I can't. Alright, so I guess we gotta go back out. <laughs> maybe not. Oh no! We're done! No commander! He chickened out and he went home. Alright, let's look for a constrictor harness. Yeah, man, but it's a dry heat. It is definitely not a dry heat right here. Ah, here we go. Definitely not a dry heat where I live right now. to be a fairly large area, but with the, all of the alarms off to my left. I'm going to guess he's on patrol, so I'll... He's over that way. I can hear him in this ear. Oh, maybe not.
constrictor harness right here. somebody on patrol but I can't tell it's the only complaint at all really that I have about the game is sometimes this um, for lack of a better term the the spatial on the sound is off like there will be sometimes where I'll hear something in my right ear but he's actually over there so it seems to be a little off at times. mistake one little mistake now where's it gonna put me back to I can assassinate the guy perfectly the first time and I do the same exact thing.
It's always funny how they do the animations for assassinations and stuff like that. It's like, doesn't seem to matter <laughs> what direction an enemy is facing in regard, in relation to you. They always turn so that their back is to you, so that the assassination animation can, can work. So he, that's the guy that was above me before. So I think what I'm going to do is wait for him to come back down this way and then start walking back that way, assassinate him, and then get those two guys that were off in that direction because they were de looked like they were deactivated. assassinating them because they're standing right next to each other if it's going to be noisy enough to wake the other one up Like he started to. All right. One ninety eight, we're almost maxed out. I have no idea where we're going now. Okay. Let's get a save. Here, let's check the map. Okay. Whoopie fucking do. Let's see where. Let's see, he was there. There's another constrictor harness passage right there. Like I say, you can you can sit there for a minute, but you can't sit there for very long because if you do, the compression that that thing does, you'll start to lose you'll start to lose health. It'll just slowly start to bleed off. Stairs. If we go to the right, no, nothing here. Nothing across. How are we doing on? 
Oh. That's right, we did we did fill it up the first time we came down over to this spot, but we got killed, so we didn't come back and refill. that had a had an alarm. Hi. How are you? Don't mind me. Alright, there's one that's asleep. That's the same one. I'm going to assume that it is. the armor, absolutely. I don't know. As much as I love that weapon, I'm not going to carry it. saw when we came down the stairs. I don't, there's no commander in here. I don't even know if they can go off if there's not a commander.
whether where else there is to go except for that looks looked like a maze. Let's see if there's anything other else on the other side of this. Sometimes there is. There's some ammo. Alright, well, let's look at the map again. Possibly be something up there. No, that's just all right. Those are just those are just ways to sneak around an enemy. Looks like. Looks like it's up this way. Stairs going down. Where were they? To the right. It looked like where we started, though. Hmm. All right. gonna do now man I don't know I don't know where I'm supposed to be going no constrictor harness no battle walker places up high Go 
here. Ah, I'm not worried about them. You count me out. <laughs> Looks like the area. Yeah, that I mean, this is where we started. This is where we came in. Yeah, I mean, we couldn't go. That's blocked. section. Uh, I don't see anything on the floor. There's no more constrictor harness places to go. the stairwell down there at the bottom right there in the center of the screen right I thought we I thought we went that way <laughs> yeah Everything is dead. That one's blocked. I think that one that one just went back down to the below area where we started. That's blocked. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Anybody knows or anybody has a guess that I haven't already tried. I'm all ears. Well, not technically, but I need 
he's an animal. I mean, it's almost, it's almost like there's got to be some hole in the floor, like how we got down into here to begin with. But I, I mean, I haven't seen in any, any holes in the floor. all along right there patch it in manually oh that's the uh that's the ausmerzer Right? Engel's flagship. Yep. Ausmerzer. <laughs> no! Alright, there's nothing there. Walk all the way to the wall so that I can get it uncovered. Yeah. Just took the wrong turn, right? Oh, wow, really? All right, so maybe, maybe we find another spot like that. You don't need to now. I mean, you've quoted most of the movie already. <laughs>
Oh, it's a damn dog! BJ. Up. I don't know. I have no idea. I went down some stairs or something. And I'm in this area now. I could swear that I took every set of stairs that I could see. Apparently not. I don't know where that's going. I, I don't like exploring with the constrictor harness. Get a save, especially after that. I got jumped by about four of those uber soldiers. All right, it goes right there. Okay. I think. Armor piercing for the win. Oh, by the way, when you're doing the constrictor harness in those little passageways like right here, you can actually do takedowns from those. If somebody or something walks close enough to it, you could do a takedown. This is rather stressful without having a lot of combat. Cause you can't see. <laughs> you can't see shit. Alright, so that's probably... Oh, I wonder if... Well, no, I was going to say if that was dropping down on the other side of some of the stuff that was blocking us before. Fall on that weapon. Get some more granata. Probably wind up leading to the same spot. Some 
kind of control room. Alright, let's go this way. This way. Oh no, not that way. This way. Wasn't it? I'm just trying to find the Oh, that was the way it was intended to go. It was the all day guys as long as I got ammo <laughs> Another one coming! I think I get 25% extra damage. Do an ADS. Something gives me that. sound is. Where is he? Oh, there's at least two of them in there, looks like.
hell is that? Is that that? Oh, that looks like the um. That's the the shock weapon. Shock hammer. I don't have access to that because at the beginning of the game, and this was the same decision that you made in Wolfenstein: The New Order, where you had to choose one of your friends to die and one of them to live. And I chose Wyatt, which means that I, because of that choice, I get the diesel craft work. But if you choose Fergus, you get the, uh, the shock hammer. And I guess that's, that seems kind of silly to me, but... Badger! What's up? How's it going, man? <sighs> so, I mean, it's, I don't know, it just seems kind of odd to me that they wouldn't let you have it. Just, I mean, it's, it's like right there. But I know that's just supposed to be ammo for it. You save. All right, what do we got? Got the big room down here, I guess. <laughs> Everything! Hey, Money Team Drado, how you doing? And I am doing fine, Badger. It's, uh, this is the last Enigma mission in Wolfenstein. <laughs> Thank you, Money Team Drado. I hope that pronounced that right. Is it Drado or Drido? Thank you. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the igloo. How you doing? This is the last Enigma mission. This this is the one that unlocks when you do the first 15. And this is completely different from the rest of them. A, because as you can see, it's completely dark. And this is a new area. This this area is not in the main game. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we finished that several days ago. We finished that on... Monday, I think? I think we finished it on Monday. I thought it was great. I, I enjoyed it quite a bit. Um, it's it's one of my favorite games of the year. It might actually be number two. Number two for me right now. You know, I still have... What's today? December the 9th, I think. Still have 22 days to decide. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's, at, at certain points, when, when some of the music starts in the background, if you've played Doom, the Doom that came out last year, you might be tempted to, to go all Doom on the Nazis. Don't, don't do that, because <laughs> you won't last long. There are no glory kills in this game to replenish your health. Yep. Yes, it was. I didn't like some of the boss fights, but I mean, people that know me know that I generally hate boss fights anyway. Although, well, I can't say too much because <laughs> money teams as you might be getting it, so I can't say too much. Um, all right, so are we in another... Another area where we're not, we don't know where to go to proceed. I mean, we were down there. We killed everything down there. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. That's, 
there has never been a more perfect soundtrack for a video game than that one. I mean, other games might have better music, but as far as the tone of the music and how it fits with the gameplay, you, you, you can't beat that. You can't beat it. All right, where am I going? Ah, here we go. Is it through? No, that's where we were. The plot of this game? The plot of this game is... Did you play uh, Wolfenstein A New Order? Uh, Money Team? Did you play that? down to the next section. Um, I would suggest, not that you have to, because at the beginning of this game, they kind of give you one of those, like you see on TV and stuff, the previously on kind of things. They kind of give you the highlights of what happened in A New Order. This game takes place literally right at the end of A New Order. So if you have the chance to get New Order, I would suggest that you play that first and then pick this one up and play it. Unless, you know, you get this one on sale. Because there is a literal direct tie-in. All right, well, this, yeah, this is the floor. Killed everybody. No, oh, I thought. Aha! We have a marker. Right? Okay. getting low on ammo, which I don't like. There's also uh, the, the old blood as well, but I, I, I have that. I have not played that, but I don't know. I think the new blood takes place before the events of a new order, I think. If anybody knows, please, you know, confirm or deny that. Uh-oh. All right. This does not look good. This looks like a big boss fight. <sighs> it actually... Prequel. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought I'd heard that somewhere. I'm going to go part way up the stairs. Yeah. I'm going to go back down and make sure I've got my primary and my secondary the way I want them in case I need to switch. Yep. All right. Got that. And it's full. And we did get a save. All right, let's go ahead and do this. I was going to take a break, but we'll see how it goes. Looks like we're maybe outside on the roof. Let's do this first.
Hey, Psycho Baldurin, how you doing? It's funny how these, I forget what they're called, these, the, the largest of the mechs, I guess. You destroy them and they're just standing there. They don't fall over. Boom! Terror Billy! Collect all Uber Commander death cards. Nice. Return home. Good, we're literally just getting ready to finish up. That one was pretty cool. That I, that's probably probably my favorite one out of all of those. Across the board, the kill board is complete. We are starting Hob tomorrow. For those of you that are not familiar with Hob, um, I'll see if this link, if this Steam command works. Give me one second here. Have you heard of Torchlight? The people that did Torchlight. The two Torchlight games did Hob. It was their last game, unfortunately. It came out recently. It, it, it came out about a month, maybe two months ago. Unfortunately, the studio was shut down um, shortly thereafter. From what I saw on Steam, the game got pretty good reviews. So, yeah, click that link there if you're in a browser, and you can find out more about it. Um, it kind of has the same art style as Torchlight. Um, action, adventure, puzzles, you know, that kind of stuff. And uh, so, yeah, it's probably maybe three or four, maybe five days, because I only stream like three hours a day, right? So it might take, take a few days to finish it. But, yeah, that's going to be next. Um, let's see. Let me grab a save here. Let me go talk to Grace. Does Grace have anything to say? Now take a look at this little creature. Half asleep, not a care in the world. What a life. You don't know Babies! what's in store for you, brother. A heart filled with love till it's bursting. Bursting! It's simultaneously the most wonderful and terrifying feeling in the whole goddamn world. Psycho Baldrin, you talking about Assassin's Creed Origins? I just streamed that. <laughs> yeah, that has already been streamed. Um, if you look at my... I, I don't know, Badger. I mean, it, it happens. I see that a lot with, with Jay as well. I'll, I'll get one when he does the initial host, but then after I shut down... I'll get another one. I'm not sure what's going on. I mean, a lot of the notifications and stuff for these systems, they got work to do because they're not consistent. They're not stable. Some of them don't even work. Um, but as I'm getting ready to say, uh, Psycho Baldrian, um, on my shutdown screen, I have links to my playthroughs. I, I upload all my videos to YouTube, and my playthroughs are there. So there will be a link there on my shutdown screen where you can go look at those. <sighs> Not sure. Not sure. Maybe the second one is. I don't know. Not sure. It, that's very, very possible. All right. But anyway, did I get a save? That is it for Wolfenstein. We are done. We finished the story. We finished all the Enigma missions. I've got some collectibles and stuff that... You know, I need to go try and clean up and stuff like that, but I'll do that all off stream on my own time. But anyway, fantastic game. If you're planning on getting it, I say get it. It's worth it at full price. If you can get it at less than that, even better. Even better. It's fantastic. Fantastic. Um, and for those of you that watched the or didn't didn't know the or didn't see the game awards last night, the game did win 
best action game last night. So it's good. It is definitely good. All right. So, yeah. So that's going to be it for the night. Let's see what we got on the board here. <sighs> Let's see. Dashboard. On the mixer side, we got hosts. Host follows from Gold Book and Money Team Drado. Thank you guys for that very much. I appreciate it. Twitch hosts from Jay, Misbehave, Ty, Edge, and Badger Chief. It's like the five, same five people every night. Thank you. The Fantastic Five. Anyway, so, yeah, well, when we shut down, which we're getting ready to do here in a second, bottom left-hand corner of your screen, you're going to see two things. You're going to see my Twitter handle, and you're going to see a link to my schedule. I try to tweet out an hour or two each night. I'm going to stream what we're going to be doing for the night, so you're welcome to follow me there to get that. The schedule, I try to keep it about a week or two ahead. Not always able to, but I try to anyway, so you'll be able to see what's coming up. Uh, and as I mentioned before, to cycle Baldry and down on the bottom right-hand corner of my screen, you will see the link to my Twitch streams, link to my Mixer streams, and the top link on that side is going to be a link to all of my playthrough videos. It's exactly what you see now. It's not edited in any way. I record locally as I'm streaming with OBS. As soon as the stream is finished, I immediately upload it to YouTube. So it's unedited, exactly what you would norm normally see in a stream. So you're welcome to see that as well. And like I said earlier, we are playing Hob tomorrow on PC. And we'll be doing that for a few days. And then after that, we're going to be playing the Fallen Ghosts DLC for Ghost Recon Wildlands. So those are the next couple things after, after tonight. Thank you all very much for coming out. I really, really appreciate it. Ty and Hazcat and Tippy and Misbehave and Badger, all you guys, thank you guys all very much for the chat. White Devil, yep, game is awesome. Money Team Drado, thank you as well. I will see you guys tomorrow night. Enjoy the rest of your night, the rest of your morning, depending on where you are. And we'll see you. Enjoy.